The History of My Body by Carlos Gomez I was formed and fashioned in the womb of a stranger that would become my mother. The history of my body would unfold as it developed in the water. And I, like a tadpole, began to unfold. I painfully made my way down the dark tunnel. I could feel the light because my eyes had not yet opened. The very first part of me that was touched was my head. And then someone slapped my butt. I don't remember any of this. It's just what I was told. As I grew and aged, in line of who was to follow, my brother came and stole my reign, and so I sowed my sorrow. When I was eight years old, I worked for the first time, picking cotton alongside my grandmother, sitting on an old cedar tree that hung across the creek, listening to the songs of the wind, walking barefoot in the fields and in the halls. School was a struggle. People wanted me to believe that I could not exist if school was not important. When I was 15, I had three jobs and still went to school. I did not work because I had to, but because I wanted to. When I was 13, I kissed a girl for the first time, fell in love, and then I was crushed. I almost drowned in a canal at the age of 13, and my friend saved me. My fingers felt her neck and strummed her strings when I was five, and she would be part of my life until the day I died. My body felt grief in 1967 when my grandfather died. The wind was blowing 60 to 100 miles per hour, and the rain was the pain and sorrow of many. I have made bad choices, but they have been what have molded me. In time and breath, in love and hate, when I was 16, I spoke to Satan, cut my flesh and bled, felt temptation like no other time in my existence. I quilted my life in the fields and in the cities, on the beach and in the woods. My nose was broken for the first time when I lowered my hands. I was 18, still a child, barely a man. The history of my body. I drank a lot and consequently I forgot. I became a coyote as I ran into the woods and stopped. In a land that was slowly disappearing to progress. I got married when I was 18, had a daughter, but I could have been a better father. She told me that she didn't love me, this woman that was my wife. I gardened our love and seeded it in hope, but hope was not cradled in love. I was taken to a far away place that I did not know. I battled against time and with drugs that dominated my life. I found Christ or I found the meaning of life. I stopped destroying myself. In 2013, I almost died. My heart was weak, the doctor told me. I needed an operation so they split my chest open. And so I'm still here. Never would I have guessed that life would be like glass so breakable. Life is a game and it's also school. I danced once like rain and dust and walked away yearning. I am still here, making history for my body. I will continue to dream and, and to feel as long as I am here, as long as I am here, making history of my body.